your everyday detailer. All right, man, we back with this big old, man, Chevy Silverado, it's huge. I don't know if I ever showed it to y'all from this angle, man, but I got my headphones back on once again, so I'm headphone gang again. This thing already looked clean for the most part. It's got a long bed. I mean, it's long stretch, man. Come around the back here, we get that Chevy Silverado with that LT, man. Um, do these cars come with a remote start? No, they don't. Let me hop in this thing, man, and crank it up for you guys. See if the inside is as clean as the outside. Of course it's not. Let me just see back. It's got some nice interior in there, man. A um, little diamond stitch. I like that. It's got the inspection paper over there. So I'll take it, it just got inspection. Let's see, 140 on the dash. Ooh, I like all this right here, man. It's like a lot of stuff to get in trouble and mess with. But it's still nice to have. Nice little startup. Everything cuts on. Got a lot of gauges up there, guys. This big old thing right here. Boom, 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 boom. Don't know what you need all that for. It's your regular standard interior in the back. Yep, all that good stuff. Still got this too. A lot of these cars don't have this anymore. But it still does. Put it in neutral. Let's back it up. Put it in drive. Turn it on. Man. My boy be taking forever to come back back here, y'all. I don't know if he be leaving or if he be hiding or what. Let's pull it in. All right. I'm going to hop out, get this thing clean, and then I'm just going to give y'all a review of what it looks like once it's done. You guys know my process.